Hi all, we inaugurated the week on Monday on a flat note, however right from the word go. Markets looked a bit depressed and as a result we witnessed sustained selling throughout the day. Eventually the Nifty marked the weakest session in the recent past. However the 200 SMA level of 10,870 acted as a sheet anchor for the bulls and despite the strong selling momentum there, Nifty managed to hold this sacrosanct support. The optimist traders somehow managed to sail through this difficult session and hence with the help of uh, positivity across the globe, our markets too started rebounding sharply. Post the smart recovery on Tuesday, the index uh, consolidated by maintaining its positive posture to conclude the action-packed week tied above the 11,200 mark. In our opinion, uh, the way markets are placed, the coming week would be quite crucial and hence one should be keeping a close eye on few key levels. Although the market has managed to recover well, it would be a daunting task uh, surpassing the study wall of 11,300-350. Till the time it is not conquered successfully, we advocate some caution. Let's understand technically why this uh, should be considered an important junction. Firstly, the 78.6% uh, retracement of the entire fall from record highs to March lows comes around it. Secondly, the 100% price extension of recent important uh, swing lows and swing highs coincide around the same area of 11,300-350. And now with uh, you know this week's price action, uh, we are now standing at the pullback level of uh, parabolic SAR which has been following the entire uptrend has finally given some sign of weakness uh, due to Monday's negative close uh, for the first time in the entire up move. Considering all these observations, we advise traders to stay light and should ideally take some money off the table. On the downside, a move below 11,100 would lead to an immediate correction towards uh, 10,950, 10,880 levels as well. Markets uh, were on a recovery mode uh, first and then remained in a slender range of uh, nearly 150 points uh, for last three sessions. Looking at the benchmark index, it might appear a boring week, uh, especially the second half. But if we meticulously observe the price action in the broader markets, we would uh, rather rate it at, uh, as uh, one of the finest weeks uh, for individual stocks in the last uh, few weeks. Finally, on Friday, the Nifty Medcap 50 index posted a smart rally to surpass its recent hurdle. Hence, traders are advised to stay focused on individual stocks in the forthcoming week. But the aggressive positions uh, should be avoided till the time important levels are not surpassed convincingly. Now, as far as you know, individual stock IDs are concerned, uh, we have seen good traction you know, uh, in the paint stocks. On Friday, we saw a stupendous move in Asian paints, Berger paints. But uh, looking at the overall positioning, Berger paints uh, would be a preferred pick. This stock can be bought on a minor uh, you know, dip uh, to make it an uh, uh, you know, attractive risk-reward ratio. Stock uh, can be uh, bought around 545, 548 with a stop around 525. And we would expect extension of this move towards... Uh, 580 over the next few days uh, on the short side uh, you know Muthut finance the entire you know uh, gold financing uh, space has been buzzing since last many weeks and Muthut finance clearly has been the leader uh, in this space but in last couple of weeks we have seen some you know uh, uh, correction in this stock stock has cooled off a bit and it is evident also after seeing such a relentless move since last uh, few months uh, on Thursday, we witnessed a uh, you know, good correction in the stock and for the first time in the recent past, the stock has closed below 20 day moving average, which is a sign of weakness. Hence, uh, we expect further uh, you know, uh, profit booking at this particular counter. Uh, stock, uh, one can go short on this particular counter for an extended profit booking towards 11,040. Stop can be placed at 1265.